I think the artist's voice is absolutely indispensable. You have all these different ethnic groups here. We all have nothing in common except to live in LA. And art is the only thing that keeps us together. The culture of art is the only thing that we all have in common. I think that there are um, families of work that go through the generations that kind of go dormant and then someone picks up on something again. So when I look at my life, you know, I pick up the New York Times and <laughs> pick up the job section, there's nothing in there that I do, <laughs> you know. So I gradually came to understand that, that creative is my job description. I guess it's that passion to create that just keeps me going forward. Maybe with a lame leg, maybe with a bum knee, maybe with a, you know, two plastic metal hips. Um, and maybe not the way I envisioned when I was 12 or 13 years old. But then we become the composite of what we were and, and our experiences. And that has to be all right with you if you're gonna keep creating. Human spirit is so powerful. And when you get to its, you know, when you get to see it at a pure core, you know, it, it can't help but just burst you open. And if you're gonna tell a story, why not be a heavy message? In order for me to remain sane in the world, um, I make I make dances. We're really heading into major global disaster unless we do some very different things. And that the only way to do very different things is to bring uh, a lot of artists into the process to, as much as possible, get everybody in the country in one way or another thinking of themselves as a uh, potential artist or an artist in the making or whatever, which would mean that they open themselves up to really new ideas and inspiration and begin to think in terms of our whole nation as the artwork that we're all looking working on kind of collaboratively. Because you want to make people think and you want to make people feel and I don't think people are doing that often enough these days and I think it makes people uncomfortable to think or feel and so they shun it. They're like, well, that's too much for me. It's like, actually, no. We need to think and we need to feel because that puts us closer in touch with our humanity. I really just want to see love like inform everything people do.